Who you draw God is a soul. And then does God created all these little souls of which we are a half. So we're a half of these little souls. And then these little souls incarnate and separate due to the process of incarnation, separate into two different forms. Do you remember that? <laughs> is she doing a good job? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Which one is going on? <laughs> Alright, now these, these souls, these half of the souls, are now connected to bodies. The material body and the spiritual body. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, where does sex happen? Sex happens at the soul level. So this is very important to understand. For the majority of people on earth today, sex is just happening at the physical level. For some people on earth today, sex is happening at the physical and spiritual level. But there's very few people on earth where sex is actually happening in its pure form at the soul level. Do you understand that? And the reason why is because we've shut down our soul so much that we don't finish up using our soul to be the expression. We actually use our body to be the expression, including of sexuality. So, oh, nice girls. <laughs> they got no tops on though. <laughs> and so at the soul level, what's actually happening is we want to have sex at this level. In other words, with one half of the soul, with the other half of the soul. That's where God intended us to have our sexual expression. For the majority of people on earth, what we're doing is having it at the material body level. Right? We're having it just our body with somebody else's body. And because there's not huge connections with regard to the soul, and we'll talk about why later, the there, there is, sex isn't exactly what God intended it to be. So what we want to do is talk about what God intended it to be in a minute. Now, what is the soul? Can you tell me what the soul was again? It's our emotions, passions, desires, memories, intentions, personality, aspirations. Mention memories. Sorry? Free will, so it's got free will. Okay, so that's our soul. So remember, that's the level that we want to have this discussion about sex, at that level. It's actually that level that God created sex to be its most powerful. At the physical level, it's actually the least powerful. So if you think you're having fun now, just wait till you get connected at the soul, then you really have some fun.